Hi guys. Today I will be showing you how to airplay iPhone or iPad to your Mac. So usually when you want to airplay or mirror your iPhone or iPad to your Mac or TV, you need an Apple TV to do that. So you will have to spend an extra of around $100 to get an Apple TV. Also airplaying or mirroring through Apple TV can be done only with one device per time. You cannot mirror or airplay more than one device at the same time. However, the method I am about to show you uh, requires no Apple TV and you can airplay or mirror more than two devices at the same time. The greatest thing about this method is that you can record screen on your device, not just one, but to all devices that you are mirroring at the same time, which means if you're mirroring two devices, you can rec record screen for both your devices separately. So without further ado, let's get started. So the first thing you need is you go to Safari. You need to download this app. And you go to Google. You type in Reflector 2. And it's here. You can see this is Reflector 2. It, it support not support just Mac, but support Mac. Windows, Android, and also Fire TV as well. And unfortunately, this app is not free. It costs $15. It's quite expensive, but it's well worth it. And if you're not sure if to buy the app or not, if the app is good enough for you, you can just try it first by click Try here. You can try it for seven days to see how it, how it works and decide to buy later. After you download it and install it, you may want to open it. Okay, it's here, and you want to go to preferences, and you want to have to change some settings here. First is this one, AirPlay resolution. Usually, it's better. You see, it's recommended to choose the last one, 1080p. It would be clear, and for the recording. The recording resolution you can see here the default is 720p and yeah, I would recommend you to choose 4k or 1080p because when you record already and save it would be clearer it, the picture would be much better if you choose 720p the picture would be quite blur or it's not clear enough I would recommend you to choose 1080p or 4k after you select that already now it's time to mirror so one more thing that is important as well make sure your device iPhone or iPad and your Mac are connected to the same Wi-Fi after you connect it to the same Wi-Fi you just go to your phone so you just click airplay mirroring and you click MacBook Pro here you can see after I click that my iPhone shown on the screen let me show you again so here before you install this app, you cannot mirror to your MacBook. But after you install the app, when you click on mirroring, it will show MacBook Pro. Okay. As you can see, this is real time. Okay, let me show you that I can mirror more than one device at the same time. So I'm doing another one, my iPad. So you do the same thing. You click on your iPad, you scroll it up, and you click on MacBook Pro. Okay, you can see my iPad has connected. This is my iPad. I am using it in real time now. I mirror another device. This is my iPhone for us. Now I want to mirror another device. You see, I can mirror three devices at the same time. And these are real time. It's working all the three at the same time. And like I said, you can record all the three screen at the same time as well. Click record here, here, and here. And you can do your thing on it, whatever you're doing.
see right now I am recording all my three devices and it just works seamlessly and after you record already you can just click stop here okay. once you click stop here you can see it's a finishing recording please wait so at the moment you choose because you choose a 4k video it may take quite some time to prepare the recording for you so you need to wait now you just click save so that's it guys this is how you can mirror or airplay your ipad or iphone to your macbook thank you so much for watching if you like the video please click like and subscribe for more useful video in the future have a great day guys see you in the next one